something up in the sky. See what we could find at uh, my 1740 house, and we're trying out the Deus too. All right, let's see what that is. First signal I'm digging with the Deus two. I don't hear it. Oh, there it is. It's still in there. It doesn't sound any good now. Use the pinpointer. Two hours later. So we got it right there. Let's put the glove on. Let's see what we got with our first signal with my day, day is two. <laughs> what did we get here? <laughs> Nail. A nail. That's it. Just so you can see, I have this on general settings. I don't know if you can see that. Just so I could get used to this machine. Um, because I've never used it before. After I get used to it a little bit, then I'm going to try a couple of the different programs other channels have created. See which one I like the best. All right.
let's find some more whatever well this is a solid 65 so we're gonna go for it in this area in this area just solid 65 all the way around and you gotta learn to machine when you get it you can just i mean you could definitely dig every signal you hear but still in there and because it's so muddy you're definitely putting on a glove because it's very wet and it's actually really cold because the wind is kicking Not too far off. Oh, let's see what I uh, see. Yep. No oh, iron ring. Alrighty. This one's 90 all day. It's small. I think it's probably a quarter. There's lots of those in here. <coughs> this section here actually has a lot of buried trash, as you saw from the first hole with all the ceramics in it. All right, it's in the plug. Still a 90. So it wasn't very deep, so probably a modern quarter. Let's see if I'm right. What do you think? Comment below. You know what to do. You know what to do. There it is. I was wrong. It's a penny. It's a penny. But is it an old penny? I don't know. It's super muddy. It's super muddy. Let's see if we can brush some of that mud off. Let's see if it's got Abraham or a nice little headdress. Nope, I see the memorial. It's a modern penny. Boop, boop, boop. Well, I had a midtone right here. We got a spoon bowl. More in there. But I'm also seeing a lot of shells and stuff in there. Yeah. Oyster shells, clam shells. in there deep. It's in there somewhere. I don't know if it's good. I probably should scan it again, but. Somewhere right over there. I don't really know what I have the sensitivity on the pinpointer yet to set at. I know I feel a rock right there. Feel the rock. And glass. I probably. Hot rock. So, in a hole with hot rocks, we found a spoon bowl. That's pretty cool. I had another mid tone here. And in the backyard, <laughs> found a uh, head stamp. Isn't that lovely? Hmm. Seems like there's something else in there.
right in there. Is it? I think so. Another little piece of hot rock. Yep. That's what that is. Maybe. Thought it was, but now I see iron. Head stamp and iron. That was just a little bit off. Still learning the machine, but I've never been one for a good <laughs> pinpointing. Anyway, but it's probably on this right side, so we'll take a big pluck. Yep, that's where it sounds like it is. That's right over there. Let's put the glove on. Ah, there it is. Ah bottom of a fancy light bulb. Must have been the brass on that. that there, a do doorbell. Let's see if we get the chunk of dirt out of there. Yeah. Huh. Well, at least it's a relic. <laughs> Not what I was hoping for, though. Might as well end the day with a modern quarter or a penny. Not sure what yet. But whatever it is, it's not silver. And it's not a coin either, it's just a little piece of copper. Uh, mm, uh, it broke in half, but it looks like it might have been something. Alright, just finished detecting what the day is too. Initial impression. I like it. Uh, I like the tones on the dais. I like the way they sound. Um, definitely have a lot of learning to do with this machine, for sure. Um, did manage to find, uh, something, piece of, little piece of copper on the last hole, a couple of pull tabs, a lot of hot rocks, and, um, a penny and a spoon bowl. Or, one cent and a spoon bowl. So I'm not totally disappointed. I only spent about an hour. And you know, to learn a machine, you need to spend at least a minimum 80, 100 hours on a machine before you even get to really learn it. Um, so I'm looking forward to learning the Deus 2. And I'm looking forward to bringing you on the journey with me to learn it. See you on the next. Peace.